That black yo magic 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 black yo magic That black yo magic Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Glow Princess and I'm back at it again with a new video. For today's video, we're going to be creating a look using a wig that I received from Nadula Hair. If you're familiar with my channel, they're definitely on my top five list of best hair company that I've been working with. So I'll be trying a different look from them today. They basically be sending me their newest look like every time they get new looks and new wigs that they want me to try and let them know like what's going on with it, if I like it or not. So I'm always down to try different looks. So I'd be like, send over. But yeah, I got a new wig today. And um, this is their box, their packaging. So when you receive your wig, it will come in this black and gold box, which I think is cute. This is actually their newest box. They used to have like a beige, a beige one. Um, but I feel like this one is cuter. And inside the box, you will find your wig in a plastic bag. You will also find a wig cap and this little strap thingy that you can put inside your wig so it could be tighter and more secure. And you will also find an extra comb. And that's pretty much all that you will find in the box. So the wig that I'll be showing you guys today is a 13 by four list front wig. It's an ombre wig. So like the front pieces are blonde. Well not blonde but like a honey blonde. It's basically like highlights in the front. Um, it's Brazilian straight. The length that I got is 24 inches and the density is 180%. So let's go ahead and let me show you guys the wig. I'm actually really excited about this look because I've been wanting to try something different. And um, this I've never tried a look like that. I don't think so. Am I? No, this is what the wig looks like and it's really really soft. Wow, I love how the ends look. They're cut straight and it's actually really really cute. This is what the front looks like with the highlights. So it has like an ombre vibe going on to it. It's really cute. This wig is really full. Like I said, it's 180%. Um, I believe that this wig comes slightly plugged. Not like a lot, but it comes slightly plugged. And like I said, the lace is a 13 by 4 lace front wig. This is what the inside looks like. It comes with three combs, two right here, one on the bottom. So that's why you have the extra comb in the box in case you want to apply it to the top or like a in the middle or anywhere you want to you also have the strap so you could sew it inside your wig right here so you could um use it to secure your wig even more i wish they would have sewed it on for me because i hate doing extra shit but i definitely recommend you guys sew it on like it's gonna make such a difference but yeah this is what the wig looks like i'm about to go ahead and cut this lace off so i could try her on So this is what the wig looks like on. As you guys can see, the highlights in the front. It's not a lot. It's literally like a couple um, pieces in the front. So honestly, if you don't like it, you could um, dye it back brown or black or whatever. But I think it's really cute. Of course, the wig doesn't look that together right now because I have to make it look more natural and realistic and shit like that. But um, the hair is super soft on this. It's really, really full. Um, I usually don't like when my when my wigs are too full on my head because it's just like ugh, it's too much hair and I'm too small. It be looking crazy on me. So if you're just like me and you don't like too much hair on you, make sure you get like a lower density so you can look more, so it can fit your body more like, you know, better. I mean, this is not going to look crazy on me, but like I just usually be feeling more comfortable with like a lower density, especially when it comes to straight hair. But um, yeah, the hair is really, really soft no shedding like i said i really like the fact that they cut it straight let me show you guys i really like the fact that they cut it straight and it's not like you know everywhere i feel like i feel like it looks cuter that way to me so yeah i really like that um that's pretty much all i have to say right now about the wig like i said i've worked with nadula hair 
lots of times so i'm really familiar with their quality and stuff like that they never disappoint me so yeah i'm about to go ahead and finish up this look because i'm really interested in seeing how what i'm gonna do with it and how it's gonna turn out um and i'm pretty sure you guys are ready to see this transformation so let me go ahead and finish up this look i will see you guys once i'm done
right guys so this is the final look i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys enjoyed today's look it was very interesting like i said um i was really excited to see how this was gonna come out and look on me and i actually love it i love the highlights in the front it's a cute little touch you know like this is a cute look it's giving me full vibes and all that good stuff. First, I was scared that it was going to be too um, full and too heavy, but it's actually fine, to be honest. I have no complaints about it. The hair is super, super soft. I've actually been wearing it for a minute. I was, like, messing around and, like, taking pictures and videos. Like, so this is, like, two hours later, <laughs> and it still looks bum. So, yeah, I'm really loving this look. If you guys are interested in purchasing this wig and also recreating this look, make sure to check out nodula hair i will have their link down below the link to their store and also the link to this wig make sure you guys check them out thank you guys so much for watching and i will see you guys in my next video